goddess of the waters, the beautiful goddess of the waters, a helpless daughter have come before you today to seek for protection. The warriors of Hindu, they are trying to kill my unborn baby and I. Please do not let them get to me. I promise you, I promise to dedicate my unborn baby to you. You will be her guide. You will be her guide. I will bring her to you when she's 80 years of age. Please do not let the warriors of Hindu get to me, please. Do not let them kill my unborn baby and I. It is all I have, please. <laughs> Useless woman, how far do you think you can run with this useless pregnancy of yours? Please have mercy. Have mercy on my own boy child and me, please. You think you can outrun us? Now you will face the consequences. So early. I went to the venue of a meeting and um, they had postponed the meeting, so I decided to come back immediately. Oh. Oh, no, no. Now I can see you people are enjoying yourselves. <laughs> yes, yes, yes ma'am. Ma oh, no. Oh, no. Miss that was so. Oh, no. Miss Ma. Oh, let's come to my place. Oh, yeah. Mistake. <laughs> Wait, ma'am. Stop coming like this.
Ketchy? Mama. Biko, where's the net? Mama, she's not yet back from the farm. She's not yet back from the farm that she went to since morning. Where could she have gone to? Who knows? Maybe she has gone to enjoy herself. Enjoy herself? Hey! With chores yet undone. No problem, I'll be waiting for her. She will find me here when she comes back. So bad enough. Don't even like her. Don't worry, don't mind her. And she didn't I am my mother you. can handle her. Don't worry. I trust my <laughs> friend. Let's continue. Yeah. Okay. Once you come. <laughs> Please me, I'm tired of that. Please do that. What should we do now? What is good about the day? You left the south since morning to the farm and you're just coming back. The farm work was too much for one person to finish on time. And I had to fetch firewood too. You're just a lazy girl. What is too much in the farm for you to finish? Eh? Wait, wait, wait. You left this house knowing your chores in this house to fetch water. There's not a single drop of water in this house and you've been in the farm, lazing around. Uh, but Nkechi is at home. She should have... Let Amadio have struck down your mouth if you ever dare call my name again. Nkechi, what is that? Nkechi, what do you mean? Are you crippled that, that you cannot fetch water? You call me a cripple? Oh, one Mimi, you call me a cripple. Mama? Did you just call my daughter a cripple? You dare insult my daughter right in my presence? How dare you? A daughter of a nobody. You dare insult my daughter. Will you get out of here? I'm going to fetch the water. It's a monkey that impregnated her, her, her mother. Oh, Chuck. Hey. Mama, she called me. No, what about you? Mm -hmm. Show me those your fine legs. Oh, no, no. For a big guy. What was her Are you hearing me? Are you, please stop pushing me. I don't like somebody pushing me. 
because I cannot talk. No need. Who Koko is in this kingdom? Who doesn't know Koko? The only man that can drink and drink and drink and continue drinking. Oh, this is the mini mini. The, the mini mini. My own mini mini. What is it? My mother and my sister treats me like a slave in my father's house. I do all the house chores. Why my sister sits at home all day doing nothing? <laughs> they have turned my day into nightmare. I have reason to cry every day. <laughs> Madam, Madam, the nerdy I know, I know what she's capable of. I even heard that wickedness runs in her vein. But don't worry. Stop crying. Uh, Coco, oh, Coco, this is too much for me. This is too much. I can't bear it anymore. This is too much for me, oh, Coco. My mother, my mother. Hi, oh, Coco. I'm telling you, it shall be well. Thank you. Don't cry. I'll be on my way now. I'm, I would have loved to follow you to the stream. But you know now, I have an appointment with uh, Mazenduko. Hey, man, I've been cornered. You must finish it. I'll finish it very well. Hmm? After which, we shall have rest over a cake of palm wine. Now I'm him. Now I trust you. They set this dish on fire. All the cassava has wasted. Huh? No, that's why it's here. Who are these people? What are you people doing there? What are you doing there? Look at these fools. Oh, shut up there and listen to me. Are you mad? Are you mad? You are the one mad. You saw me standing for my boys and asking who sent them to work. Who else do you think sent them to work? If not me, Onebu. And wh why must I notice you? Why must I notice you? I'm noticing the people working on my farmland. What are they doing there? Who sent them? Now, let me, let me ask you. I think you have ranted enough. Can you come back to our senses? Am I the one you are referring to? So, I think I want more curious. I want more curious. Okun, you had the effort to stand before me and forbid this rubbish. Okun, you have just insulted me. And I demand you take it back in full. You hear me? But listen to me, I have a good mind today. When next you abuse me like this, hmm? you have stories to tell your ancestors. No sense. Get out from here. You are just you are just fooling yourself. This land was cultivated by my grandfather, cultivated by my father, and handed over to me by my father. And today you are claiming the land to belong to you. You are a liar. And I will not live to allow you to do that. You can't take it from me. Boss! No. Nice. Come and bundle this idiot out of here. Let me tell you, he who fights and runs away will live to fight another day. Nah, I will meet you. I will meet you at the ranch place. I will meet you. 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 Come back and finish what I've said with my voice. I will meet you. Okoro, you are a thief. You steal people's land. You Nonsense. cannot steal my own. You are the stubborn fly that will follow the cause of the grave. You can never steal my land. I will never allow you to steal my land. Thief. Coward. Go back. I don't want to get up and get up and get up. I don't want to get up and get up and get up. I don't want to get up and get up and get Okwangi jeri zogu matore bule nata ndi zogu nina katanya iye jemo dogu akuware haka Okwangi kane ekele ekele oni igwe nganga nobo denga mwoke tete kedu kene Igwe 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 something something stronger than the cricket has entered his hole It is terrible Igwe but I want to ask a question why is it that the rich 
the pleasure in oppressing the poor. Why, Igwe? Why? Mazuko. Igwe. What is the problem? Igwe, the problem is enormous. The problem is great. Can you imagine that Mazunebu is threatening to take over my farmland? Eh? Without negotiation. Never a time has he mentioned that I should give him my farmland, let alone me refusing it. All of a sudden I saw him working on my farmland. I approached him amicably. Why are you here? Unebu, why are you here? You know the next thing he did? He ordered his boys to throw me out of the farmland. My own farmland! Igwe, is it good? I said I will come and complain to you. I want you to hear it first and foremost because Unebu will never take my farmland as long as I live. He will never. He will never. It's okay, Mazuko. The toad does not run in the daytime for nothing. How is it? I will summon Mazunebu to find out what the problem is. It will be better do. I will handle it. It's okay. Just go home. It's okay. Igwe, I will, I will honor you. I will respect you. I will go home. But please, a stitch in time saves nine. As the main one, we may have you. Okay? I am still awake. And the rat can never eat what belongs to me. Thank you very much, Igwe. Unebu, you are rich. But I swear to fight you, fight you with the last drop of my blood. I'm back. I hope there's no problem. This one you're talking to yourself. Can you imagine Unebu claiming ownership of our land at Ekba? Huh? Ekba? Yes. At Ekba. Yes. Hey, <laughs> but why would he do that? I don't know. And you don't tell me you're going to just sit back and watch him take over the land. Me? Ned, you talk as if you don't know who I am again. How would I sit down and watch him do that? I would never. As a matter of emergency, I have already reported to the king. Oh. And the king promised to call him to order. Ah, that is good. The, uh, 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 our Igwe should caution him so he will stay away from that land. Onebu, <laughs> uh, I'm going to deal with him. I'm going to deal with him, uh, except he steps out. He takes away his hand from my land. It's okay, it's okay now, yeah? There's no point shouting and already fighting here. Just conserve the energy so that when you see him, you can fight him. I will uh, deal with uh, him. Wait, let me get you something to eat. Makanago de Naro. With this, you don't know energy. He will just see go take over. When did he? Go inside and I'm going to see something. Nobody will come in that. Somebody is calling. Oh, you're welcome. Greetings. Thank you. You are definitely from the palace. Yes. What is your message? The king demands your presence at the palace. Ah. It's okay. Tell him I'll come very soon. No, sir. Well, I'm not. Tell him I'll come very soon. The king ordered me to come back to the palace with you. Such an urgency. It's okay. Then you have to wait a little. Let me pick some items. Huh? Uh, Bigger! Bigger! Hmm. <laughs> this meat is well prepared. I always prepare good food for you. I trust you. <laughs> hey. Papa and my daughter, you're welcome. Ah, I thought I saw you going to the farm this morning. Uh -huh. Oh, you came back and still went back, went to the stream to fetch water. Have you eaten? No, Papa. 
Lady. Go and drop that thing and eat quickly before you do any other thing in the house. Nanya, what? Oh, no, 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 please. She must fill up all the pots before she can have anything to eat. Uh uh. Lady Mama, allow this little girl to eat. Let her eat and have strength to do every other thing in the house for you. By the way, what is Nkachi doing? Nkachi! Nkachi Nyore! You see, she'll be lying down in the house. What are you lying down doing in the house? Why didn't you go and fetch water today? Papa, my hands are paining me. Yes. Your hands are paining you? Both hands. And that is why you cannot fetch water? Are you carrying water on your, on your hand or on your head? Uh, nah, she needs the hands to, to lift the, the pots now. Show, show him the hands, both Let's of them. Eh? Keep them up. Just take them up. Let him see. Then let, let this girl eat. Allow her to eat and have strength to do every other thing. Nah, she's not eating in this house. She's not eating until she's done with fetching water. Uh -uh. She can't smell anything until she's done. Is that a punishment or what? No. Nadi, whatever happens to this girl, I will hold you responsible. Papa. No, 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 go and sleep. Go and sleep. Papa, give me small meat. Will you go and lie down and sleep? No, go and lie down. No, no go and lie down. Give me any meat. Go and lie down quickly. Papa, give me meat. Will you go and lie down? Are you crazy? Go to the port there and take that meat there. Okay, no. 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 You have done well, Maz, you neighbor. Please make yourself comfortable. Thank you, my king. I summoned you because of uh, the complaint Mazi Okoro brought to me. Concerning a land issue between both of you. You were. Sometimes I, I feel for you. Why do all these people continue to pester you and disturb your peace with all these, all these no issues? So Mazoko had the front, the impetus, the authority to come here and disturb this, this hot afternoon. Eh? From your peace. Because of this. I'm sorry, my king. But the issue is that I will tell you the truth and nothing but the truth. The land in question belongs to me. Because the land belonged to my great grandfather, who used it as a collateral to borrow from Mazokoro's great grandfather. Igwe, you know, as life and faith could have it. My great grandfather could not pay back the debt before he died. Who told you these stories? My father, my king. My father told me all this. He even advised me that each time, he even advised me that any time I think I have the capacity, I should buy back the land. I should pay for the land and redeem it. Hmm? Why is he going about complaining as if I'm trying to snatch his land from him? Are you sure of what you are saying? Too sure, Igwe. I said, I'm not going to go to the house. If not for the respect I have for you, Igwe, I would have done something silly before now. Because that man has, he, 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 he has stressed on me so much. It's okay, man. Why is he stressing me? What did I do to him? Eh? Is it my fault that, I, that I'm doing well in this, in this community? You know, I'm a hard-working farmer, and, and, and the gods of the land have been blessing me. Okoro want to belittle me and bring me to, to his size. What have I done to him? It's okay, Mazi, your neighbor. I will take care of it. I know what to do. Igwe! Igade, Igwe! 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 You will live long, and this throne will not depart from your village. Give it to them. God. God. Your Majesty, take those items itself. I don't know. 
Please call my Zokura and give him one of me. If he crosses my path again, you will see the other side of me. I'm not trying to rebuke you. I'm only trying to tell you my feelings. That man has stepped on my path so much, he has put me to a lot of stress. He has been announcing everywhere that I'm trying to take his life from him. I will not relate it next, next time, please. Thank you, my king. No sense. Let's go. I have heard from both of you. Our people say that whatever goes up must surely come down. True talk, Igwe. Mazi Unebu. Igwe. Go and pay your great grandfather's debt and redeem your great grandfather's property. Accepted, my king. That is my judgment. Accepted, my king. My king. With all due respect, my king, I reject that judgment. I reject it. I cannot accept that. I can't accept it. Unebu, Unebu, you think you are rich? You think you are rich? Inflation and intimidating. But let me tell you the truth. It is not everyone you can intimidate. You don't know that. That I am still alive and you want to take what belongs to me. Okay. You are rich, influential, and you are intimidating. It's not for me. Because you know the value, economic value of that land. That is why you are rearing out your ugly head to claim my own farmland. It is not possible. And let me tell you the truth. Let me tell you. That will only happen. Over my dead body. Nonsense. Well spoken. Well spoken. If you don't mind, you come back. Because I don't finish with him. Why is he going out? Okay, do Abundo. Igwe. Look at what I just said. He has flattered the others. Number one. Number two, he has challenged me to a twer. Wanza! But I know Shibiri. Throw Shibiri, no. He challenged his God to a duel, forgetting that it was the same God that provided for him. And for your information, <laughs> you're already dead. Monsieur, so what did Igwe say? Igwe said that the land in question belongs to the grandfather of Unebu. Can you imagine that my own grandfather used the land for collateral? Collateral for what? I don't know. But your father never told you anything like that when he was alive. He never did. He didn't tell me anything like that. Eh? Don't worry. I know the game plan of Unebu and the Igwe. Unebu has seen the economic value of that land. Though. And he thinks I don't know. That is why he is using all this corner corner way to take that land over from us. But it can't work. It won't work. Look, I promise I will fight him with the last drop of my blood. Yes. We would fight him with the last Yes! Time. I can't sit back and let him take over that land. Never! Uh, hi! Even Igwe has joined. The corruption in this kingdom is getting out of Yes! And the, the corruption is so because the leader, any leader of any community that is corrupt, the, the, the community must be corrupt too. Our Igwe will have been here, go! But let us see. Ba ask question in the whole kingdom. You don't know what I'm capable of doing. Bring the axe. Bring it. Just what I want to have. Bring, bring the. Okay. Let me show you. Bring it. Yes. Are you okay? Yes. Shift. Shift from there. Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. Bring it closer. You see what I'm Bring it. Oh, Ayo! Hey! I told you. I know. You understood. Raise me up. Raise me up. Come on, you give me. I will keep Mama. Hey! Mama, I'm going to. 
Hey! Mama, you need to see what I saw. What did you see? Hmm. Mama, I saw one Mario. One Mary has committed the highest atrocity in this house. Wait, wait, wait. wait. One Mary committed atrocity? Yes, Mama. What did she do? Mama, one Mary has the guts to bring in her boyfriend into this compound. Mama, you need to see them. You need to see what I saw. They were busy, eh? Romancing each other. Touching each other, Mama. Eh? Yeah, there, where? Mama, they are outside there. The Mama, come and see. Leave the way now. Come. Leave the way. Don't worry. No, 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 no. Let me see help you. Don't worry. I need to help you. No, no. Okay, now. Claim me and claim me very well. Mommy, what is going on here? Mommy, what is going on here? Mama, can she agree to very well? With thunder fire your mouth and what do you, what's your, what, what do you think you're doing in my compound? And you? You have the guts to bring in a man into my compound. Mama, Okoko is everybody's friend. He, he offered to help me. Mom, that is the only thing I'm here for. To help out and nothing more. Oto. Oto mwano akabwe. Now look, get, carry your nonsense and get out of here. You're Nede, I shall come back. Don't worry. One minute. Let's see, I'm going to This way or this way. Whichever way you like, you take. And you, you have grown wings. You're now bringing a man into the compound to touch and he will no, touch you back. No, no, eh? No, no. And, 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 and he will touch you back. Now kneel down. Kneel down! Carry the log of wood on your head. Carry it! Nkechi, go and get a key. If you like, you destroy my compound. Carry it, carry it. Listen. Hmm? If she tries to drop this thing, if she tries to drop it, you give her two strokes of the cane. Okay. Let me finish up what I'm doing at the van. Okay, Mama. Can you, you think you're wise? Why won't I fall? Tell me what you want to do. Shut up, Mama. Why won't I fall? She has done. Yes! I will tell you what she has done. Tell me! This stupid girl brought in a man into this compound. Yes, Papa. Eh? Mom Niri, did you, did you hear her? Is she, is she saying the truth? Did you bring any man here? No, Papa. Are you calling me a liar? Did you bring any man here? Papa, the only man that came here was the Coco. She told me breaking firewood and he offered to help. Okoko? Yes. Okoko? Eh? Okoko that enters every house in this community. Okoko that is everybody's friend. Hi. Ned, is it true that it is Okoko? Yes, it is Okoko. The Okoko that enters every household happens to be a man. And the Okoko has the equipment that every man is made of. And he came here, stayed here alone with this girl without her something. Coming out the way it is coming out now. And you think it's not dangerous. I'm just protecting her for you. That's all I'm doing. You see this drunk no Koko? <laughs> what he has, people have not seen. She's the only one that has seen. Ned. Mm -hmm. Ned. Ned, I can see your, your, your own wickedness is so, so transparent. Mbe, they are wicked, very kind man. It is very transparent that you are very wicked. You are very, very wicked. Papa, Mama is not wicked. Will, will you shut up your mouth here before I kill you? Papa, I'm telling you the truth, Mama. I saw them. And you, you see you, very soon you will enter a man's house. There and then, you will see the damage of our relatives. Go on, take your bet. Go, 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 go. Take your bet. And let me see anybody that will touch you again in this compound. What is happening? Is that a joke or what? Allow her to go and take your bet. Go on. What, what is it? 
What is it? You want to fight me because of No, you want to fight me. No, I'm my stud. You want to fight me. You are the one that wants to fight me. Come and trust me. Come and go and take your bed. You now take that to have her back. Take your bed. Come on, people. Oh, no, you now has his back with his daughter. I will. I am going to use this one on you too. Why are you coming up? Follow her now. Mama, Mama, you called me. Mm -mm. I called myself. You had to wait for me to call you twice, okay? Now carry this thing and go to uh, our far land, I take back. And clear the land. Okay, Mama. Let me finish what Eh? I... Oh, you've learnt a new one. When I send you on an errand, you first of all give me excuses. Will you get out of here? Carry this thing and go. I'm not fair. Finish what you're doing. You're not my Anna, I'm here. I got my general Kungwa, Jemen, and Bobby. I have said it before that I will continue to drink until there will be no drink left in this kingdom. Who am I seeing? Money, money. The only beautiful girl in this kingdom. Ah. Okoko, oh, where are you going to? Okoko, oh, mm -hmm. thank the gods I met you. Here. <laughs> uh, I apologize for the other day my mother chased you out of the house. <laughs> mwane, mwane. You don't need to apologize. Eh? It wasn't your fault at all, at all. I you not need it to be a very wicked show. I know what she can do. So where are you going to under this hot and uh, very hot sun? Uh, I'm going to work on our farmland, Atepa. Atepa? You mean Major Cross land, Atepa? Yes. Let me tell you. You have to be very careful if that's where you are going to. Be very careful, because I heard that that land is on a very serious case at West Palace. Okoko, okay, 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 I know about the land issue. Mazunebu wants to claim the land. But truly, that land belongs to my father. Yes. I believe you. If that is what you're saying, I believe you. But I'm just saying this because of what I hear. Because you know, once I take this, I begin to hear spirit whom and everybody talk to me. Okoko, okay, okay, I'll be going now. Hmm? I have a lot of work to do there. Go. Money, money. Be back on time, mo. Mama, drink less, so. I will see. Aye, nature, acha. You better just drink it. I said it before. Anybody that touched this girl, I've talked to me. She is the apple of my back, my front and everywhere. Oh, my dear, you do. Is that come? I got my general phone, but I'm not able to give it. I got my general phone, but I'm not able to give it. Okoko, why is it that you are always drunk? Is there any day you walk with clear eyes and not get drunk? Whatever they call you, tell me how is it your business? That I drink and drink and drink, is it your business? Have I ever begged you for drink before? Look at them, wicked and evil people. The only thing you people know how to do is how to take people's property by force. But let me tell you, one day, Nemesis will catch up with you, all of you. The cuckoo. Are you by any means referring to me? Are you? Well, an evil man knows when his king's man is making mockery of him. So no need. Now he permit us to deal with this boy. Now I give the order. I want you to deal with the robot. Go and deal with the robot. I go now. Come back. 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 Anytime you are 
fighting a man and he runs away. Allow him. Because he that fights and runs away lives to fight again. And for you, this useless of Koko, you are a cost to our generation. One day, one day, I will lay my hands on you. Arabanata, Chikabunta. But Nani, you would have allowed us to deal with this. Let's touch on him a little. Boys, I like him to go. Let's go. Who are you? And what are you doing on my land? Madunebo, I greet you. Hold your stupid greetings to your useless self. Who sent you to farm my land? Oh, no problem. Well, of course, after several warnings, I told Maziokoro never to step his fifty feet in this land. He still had the infantry. He went ahead and sent you, slave girl, to come and farm on my land. What is he trying to establish? He wants to know what I will do. Mazunibu, you are very much aware that this particular land does not belong to you. Why do you wealthy men derive joy in oppressing the poor? Why? Why? Shut up! Look at this slave girl. You talk to me. Wait, are you not afraid to stand before me and utter this rubbish? Eh? What do you know about land? And how who land, who land belongs to? This is what you were told by your master in the name of Father. Well, that's no problem. I warned him and assured him that anyone I will get on this land, I will deal ruthlessly with that person. Now I'll start with you. Because I will use your blood to set an example to others. I will use your blood to set an example for others. That is it. Boss! No! No, no, Martin! Martin, let me alone! No. I've done nothing wrong to you, please! Oh, let me alone! Keep quiet! Shut up! One more word from you, I will cut off your head. Stay there, so that you, your blood will flow. Ah! 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 Please, 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 please! What you boys are saying? You mean Mazi Unebu is dead? Yeah. Do you believe that we saw one Mary? The daughter of Mazi Okoro at the farmland in Nipa, where she was harvesting some cassava. Our master said that she should leave the farmland. Igwe, do you know what happened? 
No, Funta behind your igwe. Immediately, one Mary bewitch our master and killed him. You go to oh, boy, yeah. I cannot oh, believe these stories. Where is the remains of Mazi Unebu? He's lying down there at the farmland as we speak. Yeah. You go. Hello. 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 Follow this boy. Hello. Bring the remains of Mazi Unebu to me. Because I will not believe until I see him. Now go. Yes, Thank you, your Highness. Come, 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 come with me. Come with me. Bye. I was at the farm and something terrible happened. How? A coco. Okay. So, what happened? I, I was working at the farm when Mazu Nebu and his boys entered. Entered the farm? Yes. He ordered them to seize me. As he made to stab me with his knife, he fell down and died. He died. Just like that. Go oh, now. Just like that, don't he? Wait. As he meant to stab you, he fell and died. Now I can see, Clara. You are a witch. I said it. I said you're a witch and nobody would be believe me. How can a man that wants to stab you just fall and die? You say no problem also can tell ya. You're a witch. No, mama, mama, I'm not a you're witch. Singing no. evil witch. No, uh, uh, you're a witch. I don't even know what happened. How oh, would you not know what happened? Uh, uh, everything. You're a witch. Mama. You're a witch. Hey. Again. What's going on? Okara. And your daughter is a witch. Your claimed daughter, not my own, is a witch. What? Uh -huh. Talk to your father. What really happened? What happened? Uh -huh. Tell him now. Everything you said. But what I cannot actually comprehend in the whole story is what happened that made Unebu fall down and die. Well, I mean, I, I, I need, I need, tell me what really happened. Papa, 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 I swear by the gods. I swear by the gods. I don't even know what happened to him. Mm. Yes. I can tell you what happened to him. Witchcraft is what happened to him. I've always said it. Now you have seen for yourself. I know that the truth is bitter. Eh? But can you just exchew any bitterness and tell me? Tell me the truth. Because it is only the truth that can set you free. Eh? Look, for the best of your interest, I am your father. Tell me what happened. Just say it. I'm a witch. It's no news. I'm a witch. Say it. I am a witch. Say it. I am a witch. What a tragedy. Go and speak to Abriba. Let him sound the equal and summon the Council of Elders immediately. Consider it done, my king.
my good people of Iga Kingdom, men are not prisoners of fate, but prisoners of their own mind. And since the bird have learned to fly without pitching, the hunter has also learned to shoot with utmost ear. One Mary, if our tradition will permit me, I will behead you immediately. But according to our tradition, which forbids manslaughter and practice of witchcraft in this kingdom, you are hereby banished. <laughs> Who is banished from this kingdom, Igwe? It is not true. Okoko is there. What is not true? Let me tell you what, what you don't know. What is not true? What is not true? She is innocent. Rogi me will not change anything. I've said my own. I have said it. Oh boy, Igwe. Eh? Why should a drunk be allowed in the midst of noble men having man. such a paramount discussions? Eh? 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 Igwe, please, I humbly want to say something. I am sorry. My people of Iga Kingdom, I have made my pronouncements, and so it stands. Let it stand as a note of warning to anyone, anywhere, in this kingdom who is thinking of practicing witchcraft. God, take one many out of this kingdom. As for that drunk, take him to the back and flog him until he bleeds. Igwe, 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 I'm innocent, please, Igwe. Igwe, I do not have any way to go to her. Please, Igwe, I'm innocent. Papa, Papa, please beg him for me. Take him for me, Igwe, I'm innocent. God! Papa, please beg him. Take them out of this place. Ah, you were flogging ah, me will not change the situation. Ah, ah, I'll take my own. Ah, 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 ah,
not be afraid, my daughter. For the journey to your destiny has just begun. Who are you? And how do you know my name? <laughs> I know everything about you, even when you were still in your mother's womb. You know my mother. Please, who are you? I am Abala! You are guardian. Please. I want to know who I am and why I was created to suffer and swim in misery. You were never created to suffer. One often learns from 10 days of agony than 10 years of contentment. Please, I want to know about my background. How I came to be. No one has ever answered me these questions of which I have longed to know the answer. <laughs> Look into this mirror. Goddess of the waters, the beautiful goddess of the waters, the helpless daughter have come before you today to seek for protection. The warriors of Idu, they are trying to kill my unborn baby and I. Please do not let them get to me. I promise to, I promise to dedicate my unborn baby to you. You will be her guide. You will be her guide. I will bring her to you when she's 80 years of age. Please do not let the warriors of Ido get me, please. Do not let them kill my unborn baby and I. It is all I have, please. <laughs> oh. Useless woman. How far do you think you can run with this useless pregnancy of yours? Please have mercy. I'm missing you, my unborn child and me, please. You think you cannot run us? Now you will face the consequences.
woman, who are you? Don't worry, don't worry. Hmm? My house is close by. I will get a midwife for you. Eh? Oh. Huh? My house, please. Uh -huh. It's okay. Come. Our gods be praised! Oh, how is the baby and the mother? The mother could not make it. She's dead. Oh! No! 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 I'm going to keep the baby and I'm going to name her after her mother Mwa Miri. I will call her Mwa Mili. Yes. She deserves to live. Her fate is to live. You mean my mother is from Igodo Kingdom? Your mother made a promise to Abala that she will bring you to this place when you get mature. And today, you have just fulfilled the promises of your mother. Abala has decided to bless you with healing hearts. Come, let's go to the underworld. <laughs> to go through all those sufferings since I was born till I became matured. I have known no joy. Destiny is not a matter of chance. It's a matter of choice. It's not a thing to be waiting, to be waited for. It's a thing to be achieved. Today, the step into your destiny. Abala has chosen to make you a totem of healing. You shall be great among kingdoms. Where, where do I go from here? How can I become great among kingdoms? When I don't even have shelter to lay my head. You shall continue your journey to eager the kingdom where your mother has from. There you shall meet destiny. I don't think I can do this. I am weak. I am weak. Step forward. 
and dip your hands into this calabash. Allow him to sit here. I'll be back. Sorry. I'm sorry. My leg's sorry now. I'm sorry. dying. Sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Calm down. Calm down. It's okay. You'll be fine. Subsiding. Are you serious? Yes. Hey, I'm okay now. You're okay? I'm okay. Are you, are you sure you're okay? Yes, I'm okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I can stand. Ah, you're okay. Yeah, I'm okay. Ah! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for healing my brother. What, what, what's the name? My name is Simwan Mili. Oh, Mamri, thank you very mm -hmm. much. Uh, but uh, please, uh, where do you stay? Are you are you from this kingdom? No. I don't have a home. I am a mother. I should leave now. Take your body. Where can I find you? <laughs> Next time, if I want to see you. 
If you look for me, you shall find me. As you can see, I'm fine. I'm feeling good. And uh, uh, what is that? Who's that girl that hid me from that snake by that day? My brother, I don't know. Maybe that girl was a godsend to us yesterday. But that's by the way. I want to go and see Nana. Obi, my friend, told me that Nana's sickness is getting worse by the day. Uh -huh. Yes. Hey, that Nana's sickness is becoming strange. Don't worry, let me go and see you. Your food is inside. Okay, no problem. Hurry up, okay? Ekema, I have invited all the native doctors in this kingdom and beyond. None of them has a solution to my son's illness. Even as rich as I am, <coughs> my work cannot save my dying son. Soon you will be all right, okay? So you okay? I came on my friend. I'm beginning to lose hope. Okay. Obi. Obi, please be strong. Don't lose hope now, please. Don't worry, very soon. Nana will be back on his feet again. Okay? Come on. Your enemies are behind this sickness. They want to kill your only son and take over all your properties because you are so rich. Che, who is doing this to me? Onye can major. Lament no more. I did it, Abba. At Akatabo, one of our lands, we put a stop to it. But it will cost you. Dibiapa, whatever it will take, I'm equal to the task. Go on and do your work. We we'll bring seven tubers of yam, a white cock, and a white he goat. After preparing the herbs I have for him, he will get to her by tomorrow. Mm. Okay, let me go and bring them. Go and bring them. While I give him some hands. Somebody no Wendy. Who said you go? Somebody no Wendy. Hey. Somebody no Wendy. Who said you go? Somebody no Wendy.
She's not even here. Where could she be then? Are you sure she's a human being? Of course. She's a human being. Maybe she came from a faraway land. In that case, let's go back home. Because we've searched all day and nothing to show for it. You're right. Let's go back. Tomorrow we'll continue with the search. I'm even tired and hungry. Me too. In all the herbs you prepared. Yet the sickness got worse. And after all the money and items you collected from me, no improvement. <coughs> Do not start it. I see the sickness is very stubborn. But I know how to handle it. Subaru Mobondi. Oh, say to go, Subaru Mobondi. Subaru Mobondi. Oh, say to go, Subaru Mobondi. Subaru Mobondi. Oh, say to go, Subaru Mobondi. Subaru Mobondi. No say to go, to Bali Mo Bundi. We'll be okay. Ah. But you need to bring more money. Ah. But that should be on my next visit. My new make a for you. Hmm? A blue one on our boffa on our bone. Hmm. Now take him inside. What are you thinking about again? Abi. Papa. Illness of your brother Nana is giving me much concern. You know, since the death of my wife, your mother, I have been trying 
to raise up this family. And now look, my enemies have come again. They are trying to take away my only son, your brother, Nana. Okay, poor mama. Nothing will happen to him, Papa. Hmm. Papa, it's okay, eh? Biko, Ozugo. You know, I've equally been doing everything possible to make Nana get back on his feet, eh? You just have to be strong for me, oh, Biko, Papa. Eh? Biko. Eh, -eh. lest I forget, Papa. I came on my friend told me about a girl who used ordinary water to kill her brother of a snake bite. So mean critical jewelry, Papa. You mean it? It's a wago. What have you been doing since then? You have to go and fetch for the girl. Let us know if she can kill my son, Nana. Remember, I can't so good you. She said the girl is a homeless orphan. Mm. And we've searched for her everywhere in this kingdom. But we couldn't find her. You have to go and search for her again. Search everywhere to know if you, you can get her. I need her in my house. To know if she can kill my only son or Nana. Your brother is very, very important. So you have to go and search for her everywhere to make sure you bring her. You're right, Papa. In that case, we'll go in search of her, okay? You must go. I will do that, Papa. Mm, okay. But before then, let me get your food. I don't need anything. Oh, Papa, you will eat, please. I will eat, but not, not, now. not now. Go and get me the bed. Get on your neck and I'm married. Sewa, sewa. Get on your neck and I'm married. Sewa, sewa. Hey, come on. Hmm? Did you hear that voice singing? Yes. Yes. She sings like one who is alone in her own world. Could it be the voice of the person we are looking for? No, no, no. I don't think so. The person I saw that day doesn't look like a singer to me. Maybe someone else singing in the bush. Okay, if you say so, but let's find out who is singing. Since we are searching for someone we barely know, who knows? She might lead us to the person we are looking for. Ah, did you recognize me? The girl you healed her brother from snake bite. Oh, I remember now. So, how is your brother? He's fine. He's okay now. Please, there's a very serious issue at hand that needs your attention. Please, please. What could that be? Please, one Mary. My brother has been ill for some months now. And we've done virtually everything humanly possible to revive him back. But all our effort proves abortive. Please, one Miri. You have to help my brother, please. Yes. Pico. Please, help us. Pico. Papa, is this how I'm going to die? Papa, oh, please, I don't want to die now. Nana, be strong, you will not die. Have a strong fight, nothing will happen to you. Papa. Hmm. 
Yeah. 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 This is the girl I told you about. Her name is Mami. Okay. Mami. No. Mm. Okay. Please. Do anything possible to kill my son and Mami. He is my only son. a very strong spirit. Please, get me a calabash of water. Please go, please go. Everything will be fine soon, okay? Oh. Be strong, be strong. Nothing will happen to you. As I told you before. Just like that. No herb, no medicine. His body is tired of taking herbs. Don't worry. He'll be fine. Let me have faith. You see, I have to leave you. Just, just... What can we do for you? Uh, no problem. Thank you. Now, boy. She said he will be fine. He will be fine by tomorrow. Let's wait and see. But I have to. you have to be. You will be fine. Ah, Obi. Why are you this excited? Kim, I'm so happy. I came to tell you that Nana is now healed. Oh my goodness. Okay. Hey. Wait, wait, wait! You mean to tell me that Nana is okay now? Uh, Ekima, all the sickness disappeared in a twinkle of an eye. Yes. Huh? She is now okay! Oh my goodness! How well. So, Nana, my love, is now back on his feet again. Oh, okay. Oh, thank very you. Okay, very okay! I don't want to say yes. Yes. <laughs> Are you coming now? Hey! We said, Lord, what you call it, Kadiyama. I thank you very much for healing my son and Nana. May this healing last forever. You see. Ikema, my friend, I want to use this medium to thank you special. For always being there for my brother, your husband to be. And I thank the gods of our land for using you as an instrument to save him from the shackles of death. You don't have to thank me. <laughs> we are one family, right? No problem. I'm super excited that my love is back on his feet again. I'm so happy. And um, you know, his happiness is also my happiness. <laughs> I thank Olisei for reviving him. I'm super excited. Ekema. You have to go and fetch me the girl that cured Nana. She deserves her reward. Okay, I'll 
That's very important. We'll be go fetch at once. On them. I'll I'll go at once then. Hello, you want me to join you? Start. Nana's father demands to see your presence. He wants to show appreciation of what you did for his family. Mwamili, I can't stop thanking you for bringing back life to my son, Nana. Indeed, you are great. You had the compassion and courage to change the condition that supports your suffering. And the sibling decides to grant it. One minute. For the moment, where do you reside presently? I don't have a home. I am an orphan. I was banished from my kingdom. They accused me of being a witch. Presently, I stay in Wonko Forest, beside the river bank. That is the only place that accommodated me. You mean you don't have a shelter? Huh? I live in the world of loneliness. I have no relatives. When the night falls, I sleep anywhere I find myself. If that is the case, I'm going to give you a hut under my roof. <laughs> thank you, Ichi Obadi. You are not supposed to thank me. I'm the one supposed to thank you for what you have done for me. Thank you, Chiu, buddy. Huh? May the gods grace you with bountiful blessings for this singular act. No problem. No it will problem. be my pleasure to be on the line. Okay. Thank no you. No problem. Yeah. Papa. Abiyageli. Papa. Go and find something for her. Ah, yes, Papa. Ah. <laughs> Papa, I'm coming. <laughs> Nerdy! Nerdy! What is it? You can see it. How clean here is. Just imagine it. Imagine it. As you mean someone comes in here now with me, tell me the kind of shame I would have had. But we have a granddaughter. A granddaughter that, that cannot raise a broom to, do, to swim the compound of her parents. Is it not shameful? Yeah? Every time sleeping. Now automatically I, 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 I'm seeing that uh, 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 she's becoming so lazy like the mother. I'm sorry to say it. Yes. Uh, nah, you always know what I'm about to say. She inherited her laziness from you. It is obvious I'm not a lazy woman. That is true. Eh? You may see me, may give up. I didn't lazy me, Eh? Nelly, can you see it now? Automatically, you are referring her laziness to me. Well, that is what it is. <laughs> eh? you, know, you know why I'm looking at you. At yourself, you know. I'm looking at you <laughs> because right now it is obvious that we are feeling the absence of uh, 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 one minute. Yes, if she were to be around, here would have been so clean inside out. 
mother, for a boy, girls on your home. For a boy, girls on your home. But please, look at it. Please, please. Don't compare that witch, that murderer to my lovely daughter. There's no comparison. Mm. Yes. I'd rather have my daughter be lazy than be a killer. No, you can't. You made her lazy. I told you. Nkechi? 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 What were you doing? Mama, you called me. Yes, what were you doing? Nothing, Mama. I'm just tired. You're just tired. Go and pick up the broom and sweep the whole compound. Mama? Mwa. Mba, mwa. Please, go, 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 go and do it. Mama? And when you're done, you go to the stream and fill up all the pots. You don't have water. In a this lazy can lie. Is your father around? Yes. Hope there is no problem. Call him because he's owing me. Papa. Papa. Papa, someone is looking for you. Ah, yes, I'm coming. Okay, Papa. Oh, Dibiapa, why are you here? I say, why are you here? Have you come to check if my son is dead? No, what do you do? I have come to collect my balance. Which balance? Papa, what is happening? Are you in? He's one of the Dibias that promised to cure you, only to make everything worse. Now, leave my house. What about the costly house I gave to him? Ah, he didn't take them again. Ah, he went in to die. Now, leave my house. I say leave my house. Mm. Continue with the song. I was enjoying it. Nana, how are you doing today? Well, I'm fine. I can see that. Please have a seat. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. One minute. Tell me more about yourself. And why do you love singing all the time? Music has been my refuge. It expressed that which cannot be said, on which it is impossible to be silent. I notice you have great powers. Powers to you. Now tell me, what is the limitation of your power? <laughs> to raise this man back to life? <laughs> Nana, 
You ask too many questions at the time. <laughs> Meanwhile, death is not the greatest lose in life. It is what dies in us every day while we are still alive. The two greatest things that can happen in one's life is the day we were born and the day we realize why we were born. Miriam! Miriam! Miramaka! Miriam! 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 Miramaka! Miriam! Miriam! You enjoy, you know? Ah, what do you expect? I'm always tough for food. Hey. That's why I'm called the mm. You know, ever since Nana recovered from his sickness, I have nothing to worry about today. Mm. Rather than to eat, I enjoy myself. Huh. <laughs> you like good things, eh? You call my <laughs> um, please, isn't Nana around? No, he's inside. Please call him for me. Okay. <laughs> okay, let me call him. Okay. Make yourself comfortable, my dear, but don't finish it too. I will not. <laughs> not again. Hmm. The grass is very sweet, though. Why do you still have more inside? Hmm. Life is full of mystery, loneliness, and suffering. Yet we still find it. <coughs> Nana, I came my and she wants to see you. There, I'll be with her soon. No, tell me, do you believe in fate? Yes. I believe in fate and calm. The energy you put out in the world comes back to meet you, directly or indirectly. Well, I don't believe in fate. I think people make their own life and call it fate. A wonderful. Uh -uh. Where is the Nana? I don't understand what's happening. He's talking with one Mary. What? One Mary? How? To be sincere, I don't understand what's going on between these two. They are becoming more close these days. And you know, you cannot keep a yam for a goat to safeguard it. The yam will end up being a temptation to the goats. I, I don't get it. What are you saying in essence? Have you have you noticed any funny move between them? I can't say for sure. If it's an answer. So why didn't he follow you here? Didn't you tell him I'm around? I told him maybe you will go in and go in and tell him you're here. Now call him yourself. Nana. 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 Man doesn't make a Nana! I have to come. I came to know how you're doing. As you can see, I'm fine. Okay. Your sister came to call you that I'm looking for you. What were you discussing with the woman that made you abandon me? My love, I didn't abandon you. I was carried away with our discussion. I'm sorry. I'm not comfortable. I'm not comfortable with the way you abandoned me. Eh? No, no, I'm your wife to be. And if I do the same to you, you will certainly not be happy. My love, please accept my apology. I am sorry. It won't happen again. Please. It won't happen again. Mm. Mm. It won't. Are you sure? I'm very sure. It's alright. Apology accepted. Have you eaten? Yes, I have eaten. But ever since after my healing, I have been consuming a lot of food. Wow. 
Okay, you know what? Let me rush to the house and prepare your favorite or hassle. I'll be with you when I'm It's okay. I'll be waiting. Obe, I've been thinking so much lately. About what? Mama Mary is becoming a temptation for Nana in your father's house. Yes, I don't understand. Do you know that whenever me and Nana is discussing, he must mention Mama Mary's name. I, I'm no longer comfortable with their closeness. I don't understand. It's getting out of hand. Ne, Ozugo. I've noticed the closeness between them as well. But I just felt he wanted to know more about the woman that brought him back to life. And nothing more. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I disagree with you. I feel otherwise. Listen, my instincts never fail me. I'm sure the two of them are up to something. Please, Obi, you're my friend. The only one I can confide in. Please, help me. Take a close watch over them. Please. I don't want to lose Nana. Please. I don't, I don't, I don't want to lose him. Eh? I don't want to wake up one morning and Nana will be taken away from me by one Miri. No, no. Ne, it's okay. I will do anything for you. You are my best friend. And besides, I can't be alive and watch my brother get married to another woman. It's not possible. When I know that you both are betrothed to each other, eh? Mama oh, Meo? Oh. Are you yeah. sure? I'm very sure. Smile for me now. No, no, it's for you. It's okay. You never told me you are a hunter too. There are some things you don't know about me. This is one of them. I hunt like a lion. Really? Yes. And I want you to join me today. To be a good adventure. I tell you, you should enjoy it. Mm, I was about to. Don't tell me you're not coming with me, please. Uh -uh. From the look on your face, it seems that you are unhappy. What is the problem? Who offended you? Papa, something is going wrong in this house. And I cannot sit and act as if everything is fine. What do you mean by that? He the nail on the head. So that I can understand you. Papa, Nana's attitude towards Ekema, my friend, has changed. 
And I came and complained bitterly to me. You know Nana doesn't listen to my advice. Abiageli, what do you mean that in Nana's attitude towards Ekema has changed? Ekema, his betrothed wife. Papa, what I'm saying is that Nana has started avoiding Ekema ever since one Mary came into this house. He no longer has time for Ekema. He spends most of his time with one Mary. One different thing you know, you meet you. But why I'm concerned, Papa? It's because Nana is a full-grown man. <laughs> and he can easily be deceived. He can easily be carried away with love. The next thing you hear that one Mary is pregnant for him. What to be I me? <laughs> you know it will hurt my friend so much. <laughs> this is a girl who has been there for him. Even when he was sick, Papa. Check in here, Papa. Drama. I have not noticed anything between them. Are you suggesting that I should throw one million away? You know I'm a titled man. It is not possible. I always stick to my words. Again, I am the one that asked one million to call, stay in our roof. Huh? That is a way of showing her appreciation. Papa, I never asked you to throw her away. All I'm saying is that you should call Nana to order. Caution him. You know men can easily be carried away. They can easily be deceived by women. No problem. I will call him to order. By the way, where is he? Huh. Where else? He has gone to hunt with one Mary. Take this family to his inside. My leg, as I was running to catch the animal, I had a deep cut. It seems deep. I'm very painful. It's okay. You're very right. Let me get Where did you get that from? It doesn't matter. You just have to stay firm. Let me massage it. But you will feel the pain. Okay? Okay. Relax. <laughs> oh! Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh, oh. I feel much more better now. You don't have to continue. It's time to go. Uh, no, I haven't caught any animal yet. I think you should help me. I don't even know how to hold the thing. So let's go. Don't worry, I will teach you. And I know you will love to learn. Okay? Yes, yes. Thank you.
Were you born with your healing powers? No. I discovered my powers. Did I made a step into my destiny? Did I became free from agony and bitterness? Why do you always speak like someone who had a bitter past? Knowing fully where well that bitter spirit keeps one away from being a better person. One often learns more from the 10 days of anger than 10 years of contentment. I think depression was part of my character that made me worthwhile. I thought so little about myself before I realized that I have so much offense to give to the world which was part of my destiny. The only true happiness in life is to love and be loved also. And it is hardly impossible for anything to happen if bitterness prevails. Because bitterness imprisons life and love releases it. Your smile, your smile is all I need to make my life a better one. Oh, Amelie, I'm falling in love with you. Yes. We have to start going now. Oh no. What are we doing here? We have overstayed. The king is not coming out to see us or what? Greetings, Ndichi. The king is seriously in. He cannot join the meeting. Uh, it's all right. Uh, you can now go, eh? Mm. Oh no. Are you aware of the message the boy just brought to us now? Yes. I am aware. I have been with the king for a few days now. And he has been down with unknown illness. Yes. And um, <clears throat> I fixed this meeting myself, hoping that he will be up so that we deliberate on a good mercy man who can dictate what kind of illness this is and possibly provide solution, cure to it. But as it is now, he is not able to, to be up on his feet today. So, I don't know what, what we are going to do now. This implies that the sickness is getting worse by the day. Exactly. And I am so concerned. I am confused. No, 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 no. There is no need panicking. You shouldn't panic. There is no cause for alarm. Eh? If you begin to panic, everybody will begin to have fears about our king. Let me tell you, in this Awaiga kingdom, we still have a handful of medicine men who can handle the situation. I'm telling you. Yes. There is one called... Um, um, Dibyanyanzu. You know him. He's been very popular. We have um, uh, Ajaka. Ajakaja. Uh, <laughs> He's here. And there are not other ones. These people are very well known. They have gone even far and wide to administer medicine to sick ones. They can handle it. Uh, okay. 
You go to Ajaka, Dibi Ajaka. Tell him that the king wants his urgent attention. Huh? Okay. Mm. Don't fail. Mm. No, mm. I'll do as you have said. Aga me jenu kungwa jemerebo bibi. It's me or Coco. Aga me jenu kungwa jemerebo bibi. Who am I seeing? <laughs> oh, Princess Akatwaja one of Iga Kingdom. So this is you. So you can even carry for your wood on your head. Okoko, okay, okay. if you know what is good for you this afternoon and you respect yourself. I should not respect. Leave me alone now. Oh, so I did not tell you that I showed my respect. At Nkwakbo and Ori Yoga. Now come, let me tell you what you don't know. I have showed my respect and as you can see, it has finished. I don't have one single respect left for people like you. Look at you. Take a good look at yourself, idiot. One day you will drink yourself to death. Yeah, bro. At least I have something I can do. I can drink and drink. Everybody in this kingdom knows I can drink very well. You, what do you know? All you know is to eat and sleep at home. And grow fat like somebody that's feeding on money. Lekwanya. I don't blame you, stupid man. Yeah, bro. You will get on money. Yeah, bro. Order. Order. <laughs> Order. 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 Oh, ah, what you do? Something terrible is happening in the royal house now. Is someone dying? Not yet. That our king is sick. Ah. Sick of an unknown sickness. I'll tell you. Oh, the castle of elders should do something about it. Of course. We have we discussed it in our meeting. And I suggested uh, a jaka for them. Okay, the medicine. Jaka, the, the medicine man, yes. Mm. Uh, uh, please. There are a lot of my clothes that are dirty. Just go and pick them, pack them in the same place, take them to the stream and wash them clean, okay? Papa, I cannot do that though. I'm very tired, Papa. What are you talking about? What did you do today? Uh, no. If not this fire, would it that you waited since morning to fish and you are back? What else have you done? No, please take it easy and have it. Uh, uh, Nedi, don't just provoke me now. Don't get me angry. Tell me what this girl had ever done since she was given birth to in this house. What have you ever allowed, uh, allowed her to do? Nothing. It's uh, one minute here, one minute there, one minute up, one minute down. Eh? And you still, get, you still have the right, the God, to tell me you cannot do it. Eh? What kind of daughter is this? What kind of daughter are you? You can't sweep your father's compound. You can't do anything. You can't wash our clothes. You can't fetch water. You can't go to stream. You cannot fetch firewood. Look at... We are people not laughing at you when you are coming with this. 
Have we seen now the benefit of one minute? One minute here, one minute there, one minute there. Making you lazy and lazy every day. Papa, I'm not lazy now. I've been trying my best. Hmm? Nonsense. One Mary, who took the last portion of food from the pot? Oh, I did. I thought the little food remaining in the pot is mine, so I took it because I was hungry. You did what? You collected my food. One Mary, you collected my food. You can join me. And I guess that's what you're eating. What is happening here? Obi, why did you throw away her food? Nana, she took my portion of food and got me starving. She got me starving. I don't see the reason I will prepare food in this house and yet go hungry. Just because of one Mary. What has come over your Obi Are you possessed or what? Oh, because you are the one that prepared the food today. That is why you don't want her to eat from it, right? Obi Ageli, you are wicked. You are very wicked. Nana, eh, you can call me all sorts of names that you like. I don't care. I've always known that you never see anything wrong in whatever she does. Don't blame me. My dear, it's okay. I don't know why my sister was rude to you. I'm even surprised she's acting in such a manner. Please forgive her. I know that everyone is going to hurt me. But I will be happy if I am hurt by people that want it. it it's okay. Is it food? I will get food for you. It's okay, please. It's okay. I, I will get some more food if that's what you want. It's okay. My love, I brought you food. Obin, why is your face like this? What's the problem? My love, talk to me. What's bothering you? Why is your face like this? Wait, wait, did Nana just walked out on me? <sighs> what has come over him? What is wrong with him? I took my time to prepare this food. <laughs> Obi, what is wrong with your brother? What happened? Is he not okay? I just met him, so moody and angry. I tried asking him what the problem was. He did not utter a word. To my greatest surprise, Nana walked out on me. <sighs> See, Ekenma, you are no longer a stranger to this family. Nana is just being angry because I had a little issue with one Mary. Seriously? Over a plate of food. When did this happen? This afternoon, can you imagine? Nana is supporting one Mary. Instead of supporting me, his own sister. Hey! Hey, hey! One Mary again? What is all this nonsense? Do you know that for the full market days now, Nana has not visited our home. Talk more of sending messages across as usual. Are you serious? <laughs> See, Ekema, there is no need for all this long lamentation. Eh? You just need to do something. I'm very fast. Like here, madame, I'm very fast. I'm so confused and angry. What do I do? Eh? I don't know how to bring a, a girl into your home to take my man away from me. 
See, Ekema, there is no need for all this rhetorical question. Eh? You just have to confront one Mary. Make her understand that Nana is your man. He's a husband to be. <laughs> and if she's a wise girl, she will stay off another woman's property. Okay? Uzugo, I understand how you feel, Uzugo. Uzugo, I understand. It's okay. When you remove a tick from the dog's body, you have to show it to the dog, else it will regard it as a pinch. Listen, Mwamiri, Nana is my man. Yes, he's my fiance. I don't like the way you both are getting along. This thing, this thing you two are doing, I don't understand. I'm not comfortable with it. Please, stay away from him. Biko, <laughs> really? Yes. Nana is your fiancé. <laughs> well, he never told me that. Oh, he never told you that? Hmm? And you two are this close? Who are you telling that one? Do I look like a kid to you? Listen, Mwamiri. I know when a movement turns into a situation. Don't push me. Remember, I'm the one that brought you into this house. Yes, so I cannot sit here and watch you. Take my man away from me. Yes. Don't forget that. I'm the one that brought you into this house. I'm not going to you again. stumbling block in this house and I'm no longer comfortable with her stay here something has to be done and very fast Ekema whatever plans you have I or Begeli is solidly behind you okay she has to leave this house in peace or in pieces I don't care anymore. I don't. But, Ekema, how do you intend to achieve that? Because my father has sworn never to let her out of our house. On no condition. When I'm done with my plans, your father will be left with no choice. Hmm. Okay, Lydia. <laughs> You're welcome. Ajaka, I am Dimoja Hunza, the eye of the gods. Oh, you're 
you're welcome. What's the present situation of the king? My elders I have been a medicine man for over 30 years. I have never come across this kind of illness that befallen our king. The signs and symptoms of this illness is very deep. I suggest you people should go and look for Dibiaba, a man with wrong breaks. He is also a medicine man with much experience. Ah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Papa. Papa. He's a DBA we know. We know him across the other kingdom. Ah, thank you very much. We will do exactly as you instructed us. Thank you. I have to take my leave. Farewell. Yo, Ramama. You've had him. By tomorrow, you go to go to kingdom and find the Biapa. Huh? Our Igwe must not die of this illness. Huh? Hey. Uh, oh, oh, no. Eh? Going there tomorrow, yeah. it depicts danger. This thing we are talking about is not about uh, my mind. It's about illness. And illness of our king. It needs urgent, urgent attention. Please, I am suggesting one thing. Instead of him taking, going there tomorrow, taking off from here, let him start the journey as soon as we dismiss from here. It is not here that he is he meeting the man. Yeah, it is better. Mm -hmm. As soon as we dismiss from here, you go straight to there. Mm? Yeah. You going, guy? You live long. Igwe, we have sent for the great Divya Appa. He will soon be here. Hopefully, he is coming with a cure for your unknown illness. Mm. Uh, you have to be strong for us, Igwe. Mm. Uh, meanwhile, let me go to the palace and be with the elders. Mm? Mm, um, while awaiting his arrival. Mm? Be strong for us, Igwe. Mm? Be strong for us, Igwe. How come my finest beads develop wings and flee away from my room? This is impossible. Nana! Nana! Papa, you called me. Nana. Papa, did you see my finest beads? Papa, I did not see your bead, but they should be inside your room. I have searched everywhere. I couldn't find any of them. I wonder. Nay. Nay, they will. One million. No. Did you see my finest beads? No. Are you looking for them? Yes. Ah, Papa. Uh, Abia Papa. Did you see my finest beads? No, Papa. Yeah, but have you asked one Mary? Because yesterday I saw her entering her house with some bits. You saw who? Me? When? How? I saw it with my eyes. But I saw her with me with some bits. Obiageli, watch what you say about an innocent girl. You will. When you be innocent, you make a career daoja. She's not innocent. I'm sure what I'm saying. Nine. Nine. I did not take your bits. What will I be doing with your bits? She's lying against me. Me lying? Okay, if you say I'm lying, then let's go to your hut and find out. Papa, let's go to our hut and find out. I saw the beat myself. I saw it. Mommy, no. let's go to your hut. Okay, Papa, let's go. Let me leave you. Let's go. Papa, come, come, come. Let me search her house, Papa. Okay, okay, no, no, stop there. I will search the house myself. And if Abiyageli proves me otherwise, nobody will blame me for my action. Okay, I'm going to pass out here.
You stole my finest beat? I'm Papa, surprised. I told you. I told you she's a thief. I cannot have a criminal in our house. Exactly. One million. I'm sorry. You have to leave my house. Ah, Papa, Papa, please now. Hey, hey, don't pay, tell me anything. Nay, nay, please. Believe me. I did not take your bits. I am innocent of the accusations. Please, I beg you. I am innocent of the accusation, Nay. I'm surprised you. I'm surprised. Been to hear him. He said you should leave our house one minute. Go! Papa, please. Have a rethink. She may be innocent. Mm. Please, Papa. My decision is final. Wham! Yes. Nothing can change my mind. Wham! Papa, please. Wham! Wow. Hey, one minute. Wham! Uje! Leave our house one minute! One minute, Igu Roshi! Yeah, yeah! Igu Roshi! One minute! Leave us, you go! Leave us! Leave us! One minute, Igu Roshi! Yeah, yeah! I still cannot believe that one million steal your finest bead. Nana, you can never say for sure. The girl I gave a roof under my household, the only way to show me appreciation is to steal my finest bead, finest one. Papa, if you ask me, the one million I know, she does not steal. I'm sure of that. Who knows? What made their Igwe to banish her away from their kingdom? And again, know that we barely know her. Nana, this will be the last time I will discuss this issue with you. Now, leave my presence. See, Papa, get away. Okay, Papa. Hey, my enemies are at this again. What have I done to them? Kedi Fem Mel. Abiyagalingwam. Abiyagalingwam. How are you feeling? Are you getting better? Abiyagalingwam. Oh, I'll be strong. Nothing will happen to you. You will not die. You will not die. I will make sure I bring the costless herbs for you. Money is not the problem. You will not die. You will not die. Please. Be strong. One On behalf of my sister and family, I apologize for everything you have done to you. Please, we are sorry. Forgive us. I don't have anything against your family. Right now, my sister is very sick. She's at the point of dying. 
and all the medicine she is taking, no one seems to be working. Oh, Mama, I know you have divine power of healing. Please, come and help my sister. Please. I was humiliated and thrown out like a thief by that same person you want me to come and see. <laughs> what am I wrong? I have a good skill. I am not as wicked as you mortals. I will help her. But I will not follow you. Her. How will she get fine if you don't go with me to see her? Take this calabar. Fresh water from the stream. When you get home, sprinkle it on a bit. She will be fine. You can now go. Thank you so much, Mama. I so much appreciate you. Let me let me oil and fill the water so that I can be fast cleaning. Why are you crying? <laughs> Why are you crying? Why are you crying? <laughs> Papa, please help me to call one Mary for me. Call her for what? I need to apologize to her, Papa. Papa, allow, just allow to talk. Papa, please forgive me. When Mary was innocent of the accusation I labeled against her. Hey! I did what I did out of jealousy, Papa. Sorry. Abiageli, so you are the one that stole my finest deed. My elders, I demand to see the king, the Ezenganga one of Iga Kingdom. I of the girls, we've been actually waiting patiently for your arrival. You're welcome. We thank, we thank our girls you are finally here. Uh, we, are, we have confidence in you that you are going to be the solution in fact, a lasting solution to the ailment of our king. Um, okay, Dibiapa. Please, we want you 
I want you to assure us that you are going to make our king bounce back on his feet again. Like I said before, I demand to see the king before I can double my assurance. Uh, all right. Uh, God. Hello. I'm going to take him to the king. Follow me. My elders, I see this kingdom being slowly transformed into a wilderness. I hear the approaching thunder that will destroy this kingdom. I feel the sufferings of millions. Yet when I look up to the sky, somehow, I feel that there will be change for better. And this cruelty must stop so that peace and tranquility will once more return in this kingdom. Um, okay, Divya, Pastor. What did the gods say is the cause of the king's illness? Everything is changeable. There is no blissful moment of peace until one passes the until one passes beyond the agony of life and death. Dibiaba. We are mortals. But the more you speak to us, the more we get confused. Speak to us in a mortal way that we can understand you. I agree with you, Mazukun. Please, Dibiaba. Talk to us in the way we can understand. The signs and symptoms are very rare. The gods, too, are not happy with the king. Bibiaba, don't you have herbs potent enough to cure the king? The king's illness is beyond herbs and roots. It has some spiritual implications. The king has but few days to live. Kill me! Please, Dibia, but what are you suggesting we should do to save our king? Before I say anything, you have to bring a he goat, seven tubas of yam, and a white cock. Um, anything that it will take us to see that our king bounce back to his feet, that we will do. Um, God. Go and get these items mentioned. One he goat, seven tubas of yam, and a white cob. Huh? Well done, you know, you have to go to Igodo Kingdom in the household of Ichi Obadi. Ichi Obadi. There you find a girl with the healing hands. She heals people with ordinary water. Only she 
can stop the impending tragedy that befalls this kingdom. My elders, I will take my leave. feeling today. Igwe, you have to be strong for us. Hmm? I and other cabinet members are doing everything possible, everything within our power, to see that you are cured and uh, recover from this unknown illness. But well, meanwhile, you have to be strong for us. And be strong for the entire kingdom of Ega. Today is a great day in this our family. In fact, Olisa Blua has decided to remove the whole shambles that is troubling us. One million, on behalf of my family, we are begging for forgiveness for the false acts accusation and the other wrong deeds we have done to you. Please, we are begging for your forgiveness. Forgive and forget. One day, my father is right. Please forgive me. I'm sorry for all my actions. Go. One minute. One minute. From the depths of my heart, I'm so sorry. Please. Forgive me. Forgive us. I initiated the idea of everything Obi did to you. But I did them out of jealousy. Please. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. One minute. Please. Hear their cry. Ekema. I never had eyes on your man. I know you brought your destiny to as for me, I will never get mine because of the powers I acquire. I join you both as husband and wife. You shall live long. You shall see your children too. He Take this sometimes. Use it anytime you will be sick. And keep it from me. One minute. Where are you going? One minute. What do you mean by in your remembrance? Are you leaving us? Are you leaving us? I want to travel to my kingdom. Please, please don't leave us. You're a special person, and it's an honor for us if you stay with us. Please, forget everything that must have happened in the past. Please, I beg you. Please. 
Nana, you have a good heart. I never wanted to bring trouble between you, your sister and your lover. So, I decided to leave. Nana, please, I beg you, don't leave us. You're a special person. And it's an honor for us to have you. Please, I'm begging you, please. Okay, stand up. I will come. Are you serious? Yeah. You go with me. Yeah. Oh, thank you, thank you. Greetings, no. Greetings, my son. How are you? I'm fine. Please, we are strangers here. And we are looking for somebody. Who is that now? He is um, um, Ichie. Ichie Obade. Ichie Obade? Yes. We're almost there. You yes. see that big tree over there? Yes. That Af tree. After that tree, the next compound is Ichie Obade's compound. So we're almost there? Yes, no. You can see. Yeah, oh, yeah, please, yeah. thank you very much. All right, you're welcome. Thank you, yeah? Welcome. Yes, sir. Right. I'll see you. Well. That's good. You see? We were already there. <laughs> That's good. Yes. I believe you. Oh, you are welcome. Thank you very much. Yeah. Can I help you? Yes. You can help us. Actually, we have problem. We are, we are from the Ga Kingdom. We are strangers from the Ga Kingdom. And my name is. Uh, uh, Koro. And this is Ibama. You are welcome. Thank you. I am Ichi Obadi. Okay, that's what they said. It is a good honor to have you in my house. Thank you. This is Igodo Kendo. I know, I know. Popularly known for her hospitality. Thank you, you are welcome. Thank you, thank yeah. you. No, I thank you. Yeah. But we have a very serious issue. What is that? As a matter of fact, if you see us smiling, we are just trying to cover up. We're supposed to be crying. We have a very serious issue, like he said. Our king has been sick. Sick of an, an unknown sickness. Nobody knows the kind of sickness. And we have tried all we can to heal him through our medicine men to no avail. We have taken him to places too, all to no avail. Until one of them, the medicine men in my own clan, came up with the idea of coming to Igodo Kingdom, to come to your own household, the household of Ichie, uh, 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 Ichie, uh, uh, And we took time to locate here, and we are happy we have met with you. Yes, it's our, one of us, uh, uh, um, Dibia Akba. He said you know him. He's the one that directed us to come here. Oh, hmm. Dibia Akba directed you Yes, people. yes. Hmm. Well, I have heard you people. Thank you. 
Um, the girl you are talking about yes. is my daughter. Is that so? One milli. Yes. One milli. One milli. They, they say he's a girl that heals w w with, with water. Yes. With, he, she has healing hand. Yes. Let me call her for me. It's okay. It's okay. One milli. One milli. Papa. Ah, please, come on. My daughter, one million. One million. Do you know her? What are you people doing here? Our king is very sick. He needs your urgent attention. Yes, my daughter, please. Please. Go back and tell the king that I am not coming. Hey. Papa, please. I want these people out of this house now. Please, my daughter, please. please. It, 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 I it, said it, you should it, leave please. if I do something. Stupid. Have you had It's her? a matter of life and death. Have you had her? Yes. But Please, you can leave. Please, no. Because there no. is a proverb that says, Uga, 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 Uga. So please, you leave. Leave. No, leave here yeah, immediately. Yes, leave. Please. Leave. Bet, bet, please, bet, leave. Uh, leave. Please. I will talk to her. Leave. It's okay. Yeah. Thank you. My daughter. My daughter. Oh, Papa said some men came from the God Kingdom. To look for you. Do you know this man? I never told you about my bitter past. I came from Iga Kingdom. Mazio Koro is my foster father. And after suffering from the hands of his wife and daughter. One fateful day, I was accused wrongly of killing a man, and they banished me out of the kingdom. I wandered through the forest of Idu for several days before I came here. A very sad story. No wonder you speak with so much wisdom and understanding of life. Papa told me that King is sick. And in a few days from now, he might give up his cause. Mamali, please, I want you to hear the King. I know you can do it. Please. Nana, you want me to hear the same King? Igwegaga. That banished me out of the kingdom without thorough investigation. No way. Mwami. It is not going to happen. No way. No way. Mwami, please. I feel your pain. It is not in the stars to hold our destiny, but in ourselves. Once you forgive, you do not only change the past, but the future. Mwami, please. I need you to do the needful. I want you to heal the king. Please. I know you can do it. No, no, no! Wamili. Leave me, leave me alone. No. Wamili, please. Wamili. Wamili, please. You are chased away like one who is excommunicated from his own kindred. We were never accepted at all. Why? What happened? Oh no. He is saying the truth. We were never received at all. They did not welcome us. And do you know that the girl in question is my daughter, my adopted daughter that was here with me. The one that the, uh, the king banished. Oh, what oh, Nice. Huh? Huh? You know, hey. Igwe Nganga banished the young girl. Yes. But now, she has become a paramount figure in Igodo land. People call her the girl with the healing hands. Um, well, you cannot, because you want to kill a rat that disturbs and destroy your food items, set a house on fire. No? Ah, dear me, man. It's true that Igwe Nganga banished the young girl. 
but to save the king's life is more important to us than any other thing now. Yes, yes. And we have to go back and make her. Even if it means involving their king over there to help us beg, we will do that because we cannot afford our king dying at this time. No. Mm -hmm. oh, no, I'm, I'm not sure it's going to be possible. As a matter of fact, it may not be possible. If you, we are, they did not receive us at all. Hey! Ah, my ah, daughter. My daughter with a good heart. Hey, thank you for taking this wise decision. Thank you. Take me to your king. Uh, uh, God, let's take her immediately. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Here is the way. Why? How can I leave my king? I said you should leave at once. What is happening to me? Have I lost my powers? I'm a general Congo, I'm a Major Deku, can you hear me? 
Aga mejeno kungwa jemeri bobibi. It is me, Okoko. I will continue to drink until there will be no drink left in this kingdom. I am the one that is saying it. It is me, Okoko. I have no way to get out of here. Okoko. So you are here drinking yourself to stupor. All your best friend one minute is being one of the royal palace. Which one minute? My own minute, minute? Of course. Are you sure what you are telling me is the truth? Because everybody in this community, including Mazio Deku, knows that you carry fake news around. In fact, they said it's now your new job. I'm not surprised. I don't blame you. I blame myself for talking to you at the first place. Look at me, Mazio Deku, can you see this? Am I the one she's talking to, doing like this? For? Me, Okoko? The only... Oh, oh. I don't blame you. But what? She might be saying the truth. How can something like this be happening in this kingdom? And I, Okoko, I'm not aware of it. I need to go and see for myself. It is me, Okoko, the only drunkard in this kingdom. Nobody will challenge me. A good people of Iga Kingdom. No matter how devastating our struggles are, no matter the depth of the tragedies and pains we faced in time past, in the recent time, they are merely temporary. So I see a great future of immeasurable good in a God kingdom. You see, God, He will fetch the great one. Yes, He will. A great future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their dreams. One Mary, you have believed in the beauty of your dreams. Now, Iga Kingdom is ready to honor you. Igwe, before you go further, you have a confession to make. Confession? Huh? Everything has season and time. Igwe, you know exactly what I am talking about. Igwe, I want you to tell these honorable elders the truth about the land issue between my foster father, Mazio Koro, and late Mazio Nebu, whom you accused me of killing, and also resorted to my banishment from a gar kingdom. Now speak, or I will reject the offer, possibly you will fall back to your sick bed. Uh, mm, um, uh, actually, the, 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 the land in question actually belongs to Mazi Ma, 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 Okoro. Uh, Mazi Une gave me a bribe uh, of a few items in this palace so when i heard of his sudden death i was so angry that i decided to banish one minute and i i i, I, I threatened mazi okoro never to step his feet hey step his feet on that land again and then i i now claimed the land and declared it a royal property. <clears throat> but, but please, I am ready to hand off that land and hand it back to the original owner who is a, a Mazi. 
Mazi Okoro. Wait, oh. wait. You people should forget, forgive me my inquisitiveness. But I must have to ask. Igwe, are you telling me that you connived with Unebu to take over my, my farmland? Is that what you are telling what are telling us here? Hey! Hmm. Hello. Everyone wants to change. But change demands desire. Discipline and forgiveness before it becomes delightful. My father, you have to recover your life. I have to. I have to. And I pray on this fateful day that the gods be grant peace in Oga Kingdom. My king, I am ready for the honor. Oh no, please. Do the need. Yeah. My great people of Ega uh, Kingdom, I greet you all. It is said that the world is full of suffering and hardship. But the same world is also full of victory. Today marks a great day in the history of Ega Kingdom. The day the gods bless us with a great one. The girl with the healing hand. One minute, step forward. And kneel before me. By the powers conferred on me as the owner of this kingdom, I hereby Hereby crown you, the princess of Iyi. Henceforth, you will be respected and addressed as Her Royal Highness. And all the rights and privileges of the princess will be accorded to you. He said. Cha, 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 cha. Uh, uh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So finally you are back. You are back, one minute. No, let him be. Allow him. He's my guest. You go. The elders of this community, I salute you. Uh, the gods have answered our prayer. <laughs> the gods have answered our prayer. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> my elders, Igwe, I want to take a walk with my old friend. Go ahead. Uh, Go ahead, my daughter. Oh. Go ahead. Die! So this is true. <laughs> Igwe, so I will come back for my drink. The gods have answered our prayer. My mother, the most beautiful girl in this kingdom. I am very happy that you have come back to this kingdom. Not only that you have come back, but you have become so great in this kingdom. I'm very happy. <laughs> One has to accept her fate and do it without bitterness and stay humble. Oh, come on. You know, you are a blessing to this kingdom. Every human being has seen it that you are a blessing to this kingdom. My memory, I heard the news on how you raised the Igwe, our king, from the sick bed. I thought it was one of the rumors people like Ishioma and Amara spread around in this kingdom. But now I have seen it with my own two crocodile eyes. <laughs> 
so hard to believe. Our own one Mary is now a princess. Hey, one car we could find. Just to think that we maltreated her. Treated her like a slave. We never even gave her any chance. We never even loved her. I, I feel so bad. Mama, what do you think we should do about this now? Well, first of all, you have to work hard at improving yourself. Because it is obvious that hard work does not kill anybody. Rather, it helps you in your future. If you're hard working today, tomorrow you will reap the fruit of your uh, labor. So my advice to you is to um, stop being lazy. Pick up and see how you can change your life. Eventually, you can go to the palace and apologize to her. I will do so myself, because I have wronged her. Mama, this is not going to be easy at all. Hmm. Anyway, for me, it will be easy. I will go and apologize. If it's not easy for you, so what do you know? Mamili, Mwe Jemba. Ofunwa kai biye. 